I need your tech expertise. Zephyr gave me manager's access to review employee messages on the app. Can you hack me into it? You mean log into the app? Okay, don't big time me, Radio Shack. Here's my password, just hack it in there. Okay. Uh, oh, that's a cool pick. Is that Brian on a mountain? That is my man. He's actually on a hill. Brian just brings that Kilimanjaro energy. Nice, Brian. Okay, there you go. Didn't even need to hack the mainframe. Oh. I'm just gonna tap employee messages. I have to stock grocery FML. FML? Rick isn't on family medical leave. Oh no, it's internet slang. It means he doesn't like stocking grocery. The internet has its own language now? Okay, I'm gonna need you on this because you're gonna have to translate for me. Oh. But before we do that, I'm gonna need you to hack me back into the app because I've somehow hacked into my home screen. C-U-L-H-R at symbol the trough winky face? It's incomprehensible. What is the trough? I keep seeing people talk about it. Is it just like a new spot to hang out, a bar? Could be an actual trough where you can watch pigs eat for a nominal fee. Could be that. Just a lot of mentions, really. I mean, look, Elias just clocked in. Meet you at the trough in two minutes. Two minutes? With his knock knees? Elias can't even make it to the parking lot in two minutes. That means the trough must be in the store which also means he's been slacking off on the job. Hold up, there's a new secret spot in the store to chill and nobody told me about it? I'm offended. Uh, I think they're doing a little bit more than chill there. Taylor invited Sarah for another quickie, and he attached a dong pic. Go, oh, my man, what is with that camera angle right down the barrel? Come on, bud. And it's on the employee app. These people are depraved. I mean, we used to hook up in the store, so you can't really judge. Uh, yes I can. I'm co-manager now, and I am not gonna allow this store to become a brothel on my watch. We're not zoned for that. Look at the connection between Sarah and Taylor. It is electric. How did I miss this? I know. Be more obvious, guys. <laughs> oh. oh, she's going for the bait. What did you write on the note? Meet me at the trough at 2 p.m. From? Anonymous. Guys. I'm gonna be a little busy around 2 p.m. Don't even ask me what I'm doing, it's private. I'll tell you after, you guys are the worst. And we have so much fun together, but I can't tell you who it is because they want to keep it a secret. I totally get it. My boyfriend wants to stay anonymous and it's driving me crazy because he's actually perfect. Oh my God, he sounds amazing. Thank you. Yeah, and obviously I would like to know his name, like that would be ideal, but I have to remind myself, don't get too needy, girl because he cares about you, and that should be enough. And, and when you think about it, it's hard to keep a secret. So if he's willing to do that, that means he cares about you more. Totally. Justine, we're gonna have it all. <gasps> ha, we found it. We know all about the trough and we are here to shut it down. Man, I wish we had some sunglasses right have... now. You just pull those <laughs> off. That would've been cool. Just give me one hour in there, please. We wrote the note. We prayed upon your desperation and it worked like a charm. It was you guys the whole time? Yes, it was us the whole two hours ago. I can't believe this. He was never real. What am I gonna tell my parents? <gasps> this is nice. I mean, if we had had this when we were slamming it, I wouldn't have had to reinforce Glenn's desk. <laughs> oh. What's this guy do? Oh, okay. Trust got moves. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's turn those off. Is it oh, this? No, it was this thing right here. You... I'm so sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. I'm with Brian. I'm very happy with Brian. No, I, I, I'm happy with Brian too. I love Brian. 